Hello everybody, welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks Diecast Restoration. So this project, I'm taking on a couple Matchbox regular wheel field cars. Uh, well, my turntable sometimes gets hung up. These are actually uh, in pretty good shape. Just one of them is missing a couple tires, but I ordered some tires to recover toy. And I think these are the same size O-rings uh, that I used on a couple restos on some other regular wheel uh, cars. Uh, but anyway, both of them have the tow hooks. are both in really good shape. So I'm going to keep the canopies original and just do a new paint job and clean the interior. And one thing about these, it's number 18, one of the uh, bases is chrome and one of them is black. As you can see in the bumper, I'm not too sure why that is. If anybody knows, leave a comment. Um, I can also Google it and figure it out why. But anyway, so the field car, resto, stay tuned. All right, let's see what we're dealing with with the field cars. They're actually pretty cool castings. I really like them. All right, so let's uh, just start. Oop, my phone was slipping there. All right, let's start by taking them apart. Already drilled the holes. There we go. Let's see what we've got. And it looks like it's just held in by the front end there. So I'll take off the tires. There's a suspension. And obviously I'm going to have to take off the axles. Okay, and then here's this one. Uh, and I just noticed what's cool about this, there's no window unit. Guess that's why it's a field car. And it looks like I'll just have to drill that out. There's that. And let me do this one. There we go. Same thing, just different color base. Missing some wheels. So, all right, let me uh, take the rest of the axles apart and the wheels and, and uh, see what we've got. Stay tuned. All right, so here are the field cars. Taken apart as, as low as I can get them. So, uh, the hubs, pretty good shape. I probably won't do anything with them, but clean them. And there's the casting. And I actually took off the little canopy with my little burring tool. It just came right out. I'll just glue it back on. And here's the interior. Not too shabby, just dirty. I guess if you were in the field for 50 years, I guess you'd be dirty too. Tires, eight tires. I'm about two tires short because each one takes five spare tire. And here's the uh, the uh, fr the chassis. And let's see what kind of detail we've got on this thing. Oh, uh, there we go. Pretty cool. And then there's the axles. I'll shine them up. All right. So stay tuned. All right. So here are all the parts to the field scout car or to the scout car. And I actually found a can of Tamiya Chrome Yellow. And that's the paint I use. And it actually looks like the original color of the uh, vehicle. So awesome. So stay tuned for the final reveal. All right. It is time for the uh, Scout Car Reveal. So uh, these were pretty easy. There's really not a lot to these. Uh, luckily, there's no window unit to mess with, so 
everything was intact except for one was missing a couple tires but i got plenty of tires uh so here it is the fuel car just used that rattle can chrome yellow like i said previously and didn't do anything with the tops cleaned up the interiors and repainted the one of the bases black because one of them's chrome and one of them's black so all right so if you like this video Hit the like button, subscribe if you want, and I thank you for watching, and I've got plenty more uh, coming down the pipeline. So, until the next one, stay safe.